What's up, y'all? It's your girl Shantia, and I'm back with another banger, another word, okay? Now, listen, y'all, before we get into the word, I just want to remind everybody that tickets to the First Class Summit are still on sale. Make sure you go get your ticket today and get in the room. VIP is selling fast okay and i wouldn't be surprised if it was completely sold out within 30 days like it was last year i am gonna go through y'all a list that i posted on a flyer yesterday of just certain pain points and what i wrote for um you know that you'll be able to relate to as to who this conference is geared towards okay so this conference is for you if you are ready to let go of perfectionism if you're eager to break toxic cycles okay if you're struggling with faith in your finances i know that's a big one for a lot of you all if you're struggling and you're not able to release your past comparing yourself to other success self-sabotage lack of confidence and trust within yourself and with god fear of starting over okay listen i know that's a big one for a lot of you all as well you have a fear of starting over and you don't know how to start over or battling to forget versus forgive on top of the other topics okay that we will be talking about but this conference is for you if you can relate to any of these pain points okay in your life and so if you are completely ready to be completely whole and set free child listen make sure you get into the building make sure that you are surrounded by like-minded people who who are also eager and ready to see complete transformation in every single area of their life okay now listen y'all i have a um quick word for y'all um and the title of this video is just commit i wanted to put like just commit or just commit to the journey but anyways one of those just commit and so those are the words that i had and um, the Holy Spirit gave me that title, Just Commit, because yesterday I also heard in my spirit, the Holy Spirit say, your number is being called, okay? Your number is being called. What does that mean? That means that you are next you are next you have been waiting and waiting and waiting and god is like your number is being called now okay which means it is your time you are about to receive an early harvest okay you are about to receive an early harvest and so right now god just needs you to just commit and the faster you commit to the journey to the situation to whatever it is god could be asking you to do god could be asking you to make a faith move right and it's a big move and it just doesn't make sense and you're starting from scratch but yet he's asking you to walk on water and do something that looks way bigger than you god is saying i need you to just commit okay and when I looked up the word commit, commit means to engage in or to perform, okay? That means to do. So when God is saying just, I need you to just commit, God is asking you to take action. There is something that you need to engage in, something that you need to perform, something that you need to do right now, today, okay, as we're speaking. And so listen, y'all, real quick, the Holy Spirit brought me back to a dream and um i started laughing because this was nothing this is my complete personality okay and so listen i don't know where i was but i was in some type of like obstacle looking thing okay and in this obstacle looking thing i was seeing people um cross over this obstacle thing but the way that they were crossing over it looked like um a path that was easy right they just had to walk over like this grass or these rocks and then they got to the other side. Well, when it was time for me to cross over, okay, cause I was next, that path that the people had before me was completely gone. It was stripped away. And so I'm sitting there confused because I'm just like, I know that there's an easier way to cross over to get to the other side because I seen somebody else do it but all of a sudden when it was time for me to cross over okay the obstacle got harder and certain things were just completely gone it was shaky um they had some type of like um rope thing that you can cross over but it was like just swaying from left to right like it was just a lot going on okay and so i'm looking at it and i felt myself complaining because i'm just like 
why everybody else get to cross over and it was easy and now i'm about to cross over and it's hard and you want me to climb up this thing and hop over here and go over here like i was just like it didn't make sense until the holy spirit brought me back to that to remind me that you know complaining keeps us stuck and stagnant and it keeps us stuck and stagnant in a place longer than we need to be there instead of just committing and doing it and so finally when i got out my head because i had no other option but to cross over i finally was like you know what forget it like i'm gonna just cross over and i literally started going through the obstacle wasn't complaining and i got there quick it was like boom and i was on the other side and i made it and so i say all that to say that sometimes because we're looking at somebody else's journey of life of like why did they get it easier or why they didn't have to go through no spiritual warfare or why they didn't have to go through x y and z right you're just sitting there and god is like because i called you to something different and because you have a different type of anointing and calling on your life right and so the minute that i had stopped complaining was the minute that i was able to cross over and i was able to cross over quickly okay and so listen child i say all that to say that when your name is called okay when your number is called when god is calling you um to make a faith move because that's how i saw the obstacle right it was something and it's nothing but god because that's exactly the season that i'm in is that you're going to encounter a crumb or come across something that looks bigger than you but god is asking you to step out on faith and not to actually look at how big the thing is okay don't look at the obstacle or the things that you have to do but just just commit to this journey and commit to this moment and just do it engage in it perform okay take action and the minute that you decide to commit is the minute that you're going to be set free and it's also the minute that you're going to see god move miraculously okay and so listen i pray that you all can receive this blessed and prosperous word but i know that this word is for somebody and so today god is just saying i just need you to just commit just commit to the moment there we go not even the journey thank you holy spirit just commit to the moment okay anyways y'all i love you all i pray that you receive this word please make sure to like comment subscribe and share it out make sure that you get your tickets today by visiting www.thefirstclasssummit.com until next time bye y'all